Well, Jordan Peterson would be quite disappointed in me. Okay, funny story moment. Most expensive boots I ever bought. I only had that one. For days. And, uh, I've been having a issue with, uh, stuff. Like, one of something disappearing for quite a number of weeks. And, uh, so, oh, there's a sword. It's been so nice out, I should have been using it, but obviously. I've been crushing all my bottles and not saving them. So finally, last night, that is where I found it. Oh, yeah, I was getting paranoid. So, if you know something that I don't know, is, uh, putting bones in the water bad for the dog? I don't think it is. And, uh, oh, shush. I haven't visited this place in a long time, huh? Generally, my head is down. Ah, uh, this is the most frustrating piece of cloth ever. It's supposed to be my gift bag. <clears throat> and in case anyone has forgotten who I am, $2. Thanks, Orson Scott Card. So I went dumpster diving last night. Apparently it's, uh, throw the vegetables into the dumpster and not into the dedicated dumpster. We have an entire dedicated dumpster for vegetable garbage. Ugh. It's even locked. That's how dedicated it is. But the new lazy people I guess decided Whoa. I think it looks good like that. I put it up for sale. Well, there are major reasons. I bought this in Vermont was because we had so many world-renowned musicians visiting us. And they all played their own instrument, but they're all masters. And they're like, oh, dulcimer! And they would jump on it and... Give it a quick tune. And then they'd start. Ah, I'm not holding it right. It's not in tune right now. 
but they'd tune it right quick and uh, then they'd play the most beautiful angelic music here. I could probably be better with my right hand. But anyway, it does sound really good. That was actually a whole lot better than I expected. It was also a whole lot more difficult to see uh, in striking range. I'd probably have to wear glasses to play it now, too. And I don't have medium range glasses. Mmm. Wow. Yeah, I don't know. Maybe your ears could hear it better. Oh. That's my great aunt. She is a really cool adventure lady. She, uh, her and her husband even got a uh, scorpion named after them in there when they went exploring Rupaki. So, Mr. Free, just to let you know, Scarf is not starving. This is Brussels sprouts. This is carrots. This is really expensive New York hot dog. This is a splash of half and half with a whole egg and a coconut oil. Uh, I would normally have sauerkraut in here as well, but he's had so much sauerkraut in the last two weeks I can't imagine that his stomach is doing anything horrible and I watched him poo yesterday when we went on a happy walk and he had a great poo. Here we go. <gasps> Alright. Here. Come here. Up. I don't think you can see me with the light on. There's a little dog. So he is definitely not starving. We got nearly a half a pound of roast chicken last night. It was so funny when I first broke open the uh, baby carrots. I immediately came to give him one while he was indoors and because uh, he likes them he just forgot and uh, so I stuck it up to his nose and uh, he put it in his lips and uh, <laughs> dropped it on the ground and wasn't about to pick it up again so I picked it up and tossed it in the bowl and uh, ever since then he's all like oh yes these are very crunchy they're crunchy things we gotta give him a new voice because he is definitely not a puppy. Look at that sleep dog. His body doesn't smell, but his head does. 
I checked his ears. His ears are fine. I cleaned them anyway. But... Oh yeah, there's also mixed vegetables and that much shredded beef in there. Those hot dogs are good too. Uh, I've been eating them as well. Um, I've had them in my freezer for psh, almost a year, which doesn't hurt them um because we haven't really had that many power interrupts and I've been eating them with the sauerkraut making sauerkraut dogs sauerkraut mustard toasted bun New York hot dog mm -mm, good I think I only have two packages left and I don't think he's going to get either one of them because I think both of them are sausages. Oh, I'm going to throw that off to the side for a second. Oh, I'm going to get every nook and cranny. Or, I mean, I'm going to get every nook and cranny. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. There we go. Oh, crunch, crunch, crunch. Get the camera out of my face. Oh, I hope you could hear that. Watch this. Pick it up. Pick it up. Look. Straight to the top. Oh, you got a little cigar. You got a carrot cigar? Sometimes the socks don't make it all the way to the laundry basket. He has so many beds. It's amazing. Oh, yeah. Dig the music, kids. Pray that I find a job. Cherish his new love. Be well. You can send donations of cash to 708 Chaplet Road, Garner, North Carolina, 27. Five 
never begged in my life. Not ever. And I was homeless for better than five years. I should have known that. I never begged for myself. Thank for pregnant women. <laughs> and I don't really need anything. Thank God I said all those people when I had that job. Can't believe those new janitors being so irresponsible. It's disgusting. Um, he's got a couple of orange peels. All right. Love you all. Hey. Rebel. Do not comply. Do not comply. Rebel. Find a circle, walk it.